Here's your WNEM-TV5 news update. Good evening, everyone. I'm Meg McLeod. Here's a quick look at some of our top stories. An update to a story we've been following all week. Michigan State Police say they've found the bodies of three Michigan rappers who went missing last month. The bodies were found in an abandoned apartment building in Metro Detroit's Highland Park last night. Rappers Armani Kelly from Oscoda, Montoya Givens, and Dante Wicker were supposed to perform at a concert in Detroit on January 21st. But the performance was reportedly canceled once they got there. Police are continuing to investigate, saying at this hour, the cause of death and motive are unknown. Anyone with information is urged to call police. Troopers from the Michigan State Police Mount Pleasant Post are asking for help finding this missing teen. They're searching for 17-year-old Jade Lee Sackett. She's five feet tall, weighs 90 pounds, has blonde hair, blue eyes, and a tattoo on her left ankle. She hasn't been seen or heard from since January 25th. She might be in the Lansing or Saginaw areas. If you have any information, call the number right there on your screen. Freezing for a reason. The Fenton Polar Plunge to support Michigan Special Olympics takes place this weekend. Organizers say they've raised more than $98,000 for the cause. Check-in tomorrow starts at 11 at the Fenton Township Hall. The plunge begins at 1, runs until 4 at the Fenton Moose Lodge. And now here's Chris with our forecast. Meg appears to be a beautiful end of the day around in Michigan. A nice sunset over Saginaw as we close out the daylight hours. Temperatures expected to be cold again tonight, falling to the single numbers, but it looks like once we achieve midnight, that's where our temperatures will start to stabilize a little bit and we'll actually see them rise into tomorrow morning. And as we're rising all night and through the day tomorrow, we should achieve highs tomorrow in the upper 20s to low 30s, so significantly warmer than today. And our wind chills, while they will start cold tomorrow morning, should improve quite a bit as we go through your Saturday. Upper teens and low 20s for the afternoon. Your first alert, Pinpoint Doppler Radar, live from MBS, is dry tonight. We do expect to stay mostly dry this weekend. Your hour by hour forecast shows clouds move back in tonight and a few snow showers are possible to the north, but those will move out pretty quickly and the rest of your Saturday is just fine. We'll have a chance for some sunshine late in the morning and early afternoon before eventually the clouds return on Saturday evening ahead of our next system on Sunday, which brings at least a few scattered rain and snow showers throughout the day. These do not look very heavy and should be a very minor thing if your town even sees them at all. Seven day forecast shows 30s return early next week on Monday. Also, our chance for rain returns on Tuesday and we'll have another chance after that on Thursday. Remember to tune into WNEM TV 5 on air and online 24 7 for the latest news, weather and information.